This is Dan Aykroyd, and you are watching Port Daniel News. Hello and welcome to another edition of the Port Daniel News. I'm your host, D.L. Sudbury. Tonight we're coming to you from the third annual Labatt Blue Pond Hockey Tournament. And what can I tell you, ladies and gentlemen? 114 teams competing, over 700 players, and I tell you, wow. Vancouver ain't got nothing on this place, eh? We lost, what was the score? 12 to 7. It doesn't matter when you lose, eh? It's tough with, tough with the snow. Oh, we'd probably have to win the next two games tomorrow to uh, compete. Have to go 3 and 0. So, we're just happy about the experience. Experience is fun here. Another hard luck story here at the third annual Blue Pond Hockey Tournament. Uh, we're the five holes. Uh, we won our first game, waiting to go on our second uh, ice for the second game. Frozen semen straight up. <laughs> That's how we roll. Don't give us a microwave, thaw us out, we get crazy. <laughs> we're, only at, we're only about two hours behind, so we'll get out there eventually. It's a pregame skate. Oh, <laughs> I was just telling her they're going to need to change the game. There is no skating out there. It's a little sloppy. Is it? Yeah. I would cancel the, the uh, pond hockey tournament and sign up for the slush volleyball game. They're not going to be able to skate on that. There ain't no playing. I wish I knew how to play hockey. No. I could attempt it. You can try. <laughs> what do you think of this guy's hat back there? <laughs> I tell you, here at the third annual about Blue Pond Hockey Tournament, they don't discriminate. They got the ladies out here playing, and I'm telling you, check out some of these lady players. They're killing. We have just under a thousand spectators here and they're jamming the hot dog and sausage stands. The beer tents just packed beyond belief. We're here at the Polaris Yamaha uh, Performance Center. They got some wicked looking performing ATVs. We got some snowmobiles hopping in here. We got a little bit, we're doing some of the sponsoring with Labatt's and uh, we brought some of the equipment down. Some of ours is, you'll see it out plowing the, the rinks and everything. They needed something to clear all that ice off. And uh, so we helped them along and they told us, come on down, we'll do some more sponsoring with them. Cool. Tell us a little bit about what you got here. What's, what's going on? Selling these things or are these just for the thing? They're for sale. They we, are? Yep. But just to introduce some people, especially if you're here in the city, people aren't always exposed to stuff that's, you know, outside here. You know, they think, it's kind of cool. What would I do with it? Where would I ride? So we give them that information, give them some idea what they would do with the rest of their time. And, and where will I be taking the test drive with it, right? <laughs> Seriously, how much would one of these suckers run? Speed-wise or? No, well, speed-wise and then the price. Hit me with the good stuff, then the bad stuff. Speed-wise, you're probably looking somewhere around that uh, on a perfect condition day, about 115. Wow. What? Uh, Price-wise, with all the rebates on it, you're looking at like 10 2 now. It's a maintenance You're watching the Port Daniel News.